Hello, my name is Jason Perkins, and I'm a Georgia attorney who specializes in helping people who've been injured at work with their workers' compensation claims. Today I want to talk to you about an important deadline in the workers' compensation law. That de deadline is contained in the Georgia law at OCGA 34-9-203, and it's what's known as the medical bill or mileage statute of limitations. What this deadline means is that there's a deadline for submitting your request for reimbursement for payment of medical bills or mileage. Now, the workers' compensation law allows you to pay for treatment for your injury and get reimbursed for that treatment. For example, if your authorized treating physician, that's your main workers' compensation doctor, prescribes some medication for you and you go and pay for that medication out of pocket, you can submit your receipt for payment for that medication to the insurance company and get reimbursed by them for it. Same time, you're also entitled to reimbursement for your mileage. You drive to an appointment with your authorized treating physician or a test ordered by your authorized treating physician or any other medical treatment related to your injury, you're entitled to be reimbursed for that mileage at 40 cents per mile. However, with the medical bill or mileage statute of limitations in OCGA 34-9-203 means is that you have to submit your request for reimbursement within one year of when it's incurred. If you don't, the insurance company can just say that they're not going to pay you for it. You've waited too long. So be sure and submit your request for reimbursements within that time frame. Now statutes of limitation the deadlines I'm talking about here often have exceptions. So if you've waited more than a year, you may still want to check with an attorney like me to make sure that you can't re be reimbursed for that treatment. There may be an exception and you may still be able to get reimbursed. But the best thing to do is be sure and submit your request for reimbursement within that one year. And then you don't have to worry about it. I hope you found this video helpful today. If you have, please let me know by giving a thumbs up on YouTube. You can also go to our Perkins Law Firm YouTube channel and subscribe there to be notified of further videos. And you can check out my other workers' compensation videos there as well. Thanks for watching today, and best of luck to you in the future.